I'm Evelyn Calderon. And I'm Brooke Johnson. And, and we're, we're the, the minorities. minorities. Today we asked high school students around campus commonly found questions in the fifth grade classroom. And we asked fifth graders the exact same question. Are you smarter than fifth graders? <laughs> Roll the clip. <laughs> You're supposed to... What's the planet closest to the sun? Mercury. What's the planet closest to the sun? Mm -hmm. Mars? <laughs> Mars, are you sure about Mars? No, Mercury? I don't know, I don't know. The moon, isn't it? The moon, isn't it? I still love you! What's the planet closest to the sun? Mercury. What's the planet closest to the sun? Um. How do you say Mercury? Mercury? Something? Yeah. What's the planet closest to the sun? Mercury. What planet is closest to the sun? Mars. Are you sure? Yeah, because it's red. <laughs> What's the planet closest to the sun? Mercury. What's the planet closest to the sun? Mercury. How many centimeters are in one inch? Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> five? <laughs> I don't know. Five? I'll go with five, yeah. No, it's ten. Wait. How many centimeters are in one inch? Yeah, it's five. How many centimeters are in an inch? 2.5. How many centimeters are in one inch? Six. How many centimeters are in one inch? Um, 2.5. How many centimeters are in one inch? Um, 60. <laughs> 60 centimeters are in one inch? Yeah. <laughs> How many centimeters are in one inch? 2.5. How many centimeters are in one inch? Centimeters in one inch. There aren't any centimeters in an inch. That's nonsense. And you should know better. How many centimeters are in an inch? 2.5. How many sides does a rhombus have? I don't know. Like, I don't know. <laughs> um, I go with eight. <laughs> How many sides are in a rhombus? Four. How many sides are in a rhombus? Six. <laughs> Six sides on a rhombus. Yeah. Can you show us what a rhombus is? That's like the square thing, and like a pointy, right? Like pointy? To the right? Yeah. How many sides are in a rhombus? Four. How many sides does a rhombus have? Four. How many sides are in a rhombus? Four. How many sides are in a rhombus? Three? What's a rhombus? Like a rectangle? <laughs> I don't know. A rectangle? Slanted? So how many sides? One, two, four. Four sides? Yeah. Or, or are they like different shapes, so it sticks? <laughs> <laughs> or, or are they like different shapes, shapes, so it sticks? How many sides are in a rhombus? Four. How many sides does a rhombus have? How many sides does a rhombus have? That's a math question. Um, eight. How many sides are in a rhombus? Four. What's heavier, a pound of feathers or a pound of bricks? A pound of bricks. What's heavier, a pound of bricks or a pound of feathers? They're the same, you just said it. What's heavier, a pound of bricks or a pound of feathers? 
a pound of bricks. Mm. What's heavier, a pound of bricks or a pound of feathers? A pound of bricks or a pound of feathers? Well, since they're both pounds, uh, that means that they're probably both a pound. Are you smarter than a fifth grader?